Yesterday, we showed you part one of my interview with former heavyweight champion Mike Tyson, and today we continue. Tyson talks about his legendary boxing career and his current hobbies and more. And I think in my career, I think like who I would have liked to have interviewed and didn't get a chance to. Is there anyone you wish you could have boxed? Any big name you wish you could have boxed and you never got a chance to? No way. I did everything I was entitled to do in my career. There's um, nothing um, I regret. All right. The last time that I that I saw you, I was in Vegas uh, at your house interviewing you, and you showed me your garage or an area offside your house where you looked like you had like a thousand pigeons. Do you still have all those pigeons? Absolutely. I, I even have more in New York I, and, and in New Jersey. I just love birds. That's just who I am. I'm from Brooklyn, New York, and I'm a typical Brooklyn guy that have pigeons on his roof. <laughs> Is it only pigeons, or do you like other birds too? Excuse me? No, it's just pigeons. It, just pigeons. And, and what do you do with them? Um, what? I clean their coops every day. I give them water. I feed them. And I fly them. All right. Um, all right. Ted, the other day I saw a picture of you. You were in a wheelchair. What was that all about? Oh, I have sciatica every now and then. It flares up. And when it flares up, I can't even talk. Is that the only health problem you got right now? I mean, hopefully that's the only thing you have. And you don't even, I mean, it, uh, yes, I hope you don't have sciatica right thank now. God. But it's otherwise, you're in good health. You're, you're in good in health. All right. Health. Um, yeah. uh, all right, good. So I know you've, you've down in Florida. You've moved there with your family. Things are pretty good. Is that, is that fair to say? Your life's good? Oh, everybody in my house is truly blessed. And we're all very grateful for whatever we have. Now, I know you've you got an interest in boxing. Are there other sports that you watch? I watch tennis. Tennis is—I watch tennis more than I watch boxing. Do you play tennis? Tennis and golf. Can you believe that? I thought, I thought golf was a horrible sport until I watched it live. And, it, and it's an incredible sport. Are you any good at it? No. One time I tried to hit a ball in the golf club, went out my hand. And, and oh, man, I'm so glad I didn't hit about, anyone. How about tennis? Are you any good at tennis? No, I hit the ball like I'm playing baseball. It's not working out too well for me. Have you thought about playing pickleball, which is sort of like, uh, what's a little bit like tennis? Do you know pickleball? Yes. Is? Yes. I'm, I'm, I'd rather play pickleball. All right, good. All right, um, now, we've talked about sports, we've talked about your career. How about politics? Do you follow politics at all? I, listen, if I start talking politics, my friends are not going to like me. Hey, let's just not do that, okay? Let's just not oh, do on. that. All right, tell me. Get, my fam my family right, well, now you've get teased mad, me my friends get mad when we talk politics. All right, well, just give me a little bit of tease. Do you go to, to the far right of the spectrum or the far left of the spectrum in politics? Are you conservative or liberal? Now, listen, when I was younger, I was all-out liberal. But as I get older and I look at my children and I see what's out in the world, I get a little conservative. You know, it, it, it's common sense. Looking at the world at the stage well, you're right now, you want safety. You're down in Florida, and you've got some pretty interesting politicians. DeSantis, and you've got President Trump. What do you think about those two? Those are two now, the ones you have in your state, now they live there. Hey, listen, um, I, I, can't name, I can't talk about no politicians. It's just last time I put my hat in the arena and gave my opinion, and wow, did they, did they give me a beating? Who gave you a beating? I don't think anyone gives Mike Tyson a beating, by the way. I've seen, I've seen, I've listen, seen, I've listen. seen, oh, maybe the I'm press. I'm going to stay away from politics and, <laughs> I'm going to stay away from politics and religion. I used to be, they stole my, my freedom of speech. <laughs> I'm not going to say anything. <laughs> oh, these all people. right, I can't, all right. It's, anyway, all right, well, anyway, um, uh, Mike, it's always nice to, t uh, nice to talk to you. Uh, like I said in the beginning, um, I think Hulu should at least call you as a courtesy, uh, should have consulted you, probably would have better series if they actually talked to the person they're doing a series on. 
Um, and frankly, I, I, you know, it's, since they're using your name, I must admit, I think you should get some money out of this, but that's just me. Listen, I'm not thinking about the money. I'm just happy that I'm not mad at anyone. You know, life is beautiful. <laughs> life is indeed beautiful. Mike, nice to talk to you. Thank you, Greta. You look great.